Hey guys, it's Amber Gal. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about all the things that I didn't know about before I became a mom. And you know what? There's quite a few things, but we're going to narrow it down to seven things that I have learned since becoming a mother. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe. It's just down below. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and thanks for watching guys. Number one, when you first become a parent, it is very, very brutally honest that you are gonna be so much busier than you ever were before having children. It doesn't matter if you were working in a high corporate office building, you had such a crazy busy job, you were highly on call for your job this job called parenthood it doesn't have a day off you wake up and your main sole purpose is to keep a human alive and to make it even more exciting it is a baby human and that human can't do anything for themselves and then at night time you would think that you can rest but you're wrong <laughs> Even though babies do get into a better sleep as they get older and then eventually they do sleep through the night as they are toddlers and younger children, but it can be a long process and some days there are days where you just can't believe it is still 9 a.m. Number two, your wallet will be extremely lighter. And, of course, children are going to cost a pretty penny. And the funny thing is, is before I had children, I thought that, like, babies were super expensive. But actually, they get way more expensive as they get older. Number three. You are going to be so much more grateful for your alone time, including bathroom time, shower time, let's get dressed time, let's wake up time. Those are things you really take for granted before you have kids because you kind of just expect that that is a human need to be able to go to the bathroom by yourself. But children surprise you and guess what? You're wrong. Number four. Your food is no longer your own food. Because if you have something that looks remotely delicious to your children, it's gonna be in their mouth. And they are going to cry until they get to try some. That's why if you are a sneaky parent, you save all those treats and goodies for when they're sleeping. Number five. You are going to be so much more tired. Number six. And I'm not going to show you those amount of fingers because one of my hands is holding the camera. <laughs> anyway, number six. You realize why your parents wanted to show you all the things they did when they were little. Because somehow all of that memory land stuff happens with you and then your kids and then you stop and you wonder is this how my kids are feeling am i kind of putting my kids in the same place that my parents did when they talked about back in the day and lastly guys number seven you never would have known that you could love a human being as much as you do once you become a parent. And that love that you feel for your child is just so unlike anything else that all the other love that you feel in your life is very, very weakened. I shouldn't say weakened, but I guess it's very, very um, almost like watered down compared to the love you have for your child. I'm not saying that you can't love your husband or wife in a very deep and passionate and loving way but the love you have for your child is just so deep and pure and it's just so different 
Thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to hit subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Bye guys.